bad. Oh, it could be worse, but I shudder to think how. Well, uh, can you stop that long enough to tell me what's so terrible? <sighs> Frances is a frail woman, John. She's driving him to the devil. Oh, lady, lady. Frank has a mind of his own. He is stronger than any ten Charlotte Greers. Yes. With normal people, he is. But that woman, she's so evil. He doesn't know how to deal with her. He's never confronted that before, John. Um, Jillian is terrified. It can't go on forever. It has to end somewhere. Oh, yes. Somewhere. But we don't even know why this is happening. Or what that woman wants. What do we do about it? What do we do? We just have to have faith in Frank's ability to handle the situation. Yes, please, God. I'm trying to have faith, John. But I just wish there was something that I could do to ease my son's plight. I hate to think the only thing I'm left doing is washing the window. At least we'll have the cleanest windows in the neighborhood when this thing is over. And it will be over someday, I promise you. Oh, I'm sure of it. But just think of all Jimmy's and Francis' beautiful plans, the damage that's been done. They will weather this. Oh, I'm sure. Oh, I haven't even told you the worst. Well, what? What? Come on, tell me. She called him last night. How do you know? Because he called me late this morning. When can we see him? I don't know. I could already tell that he was in that distant, far-off, determined place. I just wish I could wrap him in the family so she couldn't get to him. Where is he now? His office? No. He said he was going out to look for her, where he found her before. If we just give it up. Hello? I expected to hear from you earlier. There's been some disagreement about our plans. I need you now. It's critical that you get here as soon as possible. Then we must make it possible, mustn't we? Just a minute. Yes, what is it? I'm sorry. I know you haven't felt well, but it really is necessary for you to complete the arrangements and come as soon as possible. It was not myself that caused the delay, my dear. We'll move quickly now. Sure, you can count on it. WTJ-TV, I'm very excited about the challenge that it represents for me. Tom, very sweetly, did not mention the fact that I have absolutely no experience in broadcasting. I do have a lot of ideas, and I know that there's an awful lot of uh, capability and talent right here in this room. Tom has promised that he will show me the ropes, and I'm expecting feedback from everyone here. We're all in this together. We all want the same thing. And I, I, I did not have to be here. Like I am going to ring out. Tom Jones. I'm open to suggestions. Lovely opportunity if you to congratulate Lee, even uh, offer a little expert advice. Oh, no you may about. become her <laughs> man. <laughs> Besides, it's a terrific rain. Look at Jack. He's furious. Excellent staff that you've assembled. And as my first move to boost ratings, I am very pleased to announce that WTJ is putting Jack Finelli. Back on the evening news, three days a week with a feature story. Come on, Jack. Come on up and take a bow. Jack, don't be shy. Oh, I Roger, I'm leaving. Not yet. It's just getting interesting. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> well, uh, ladies and gentlemen, I must say that in the brief time I've known Miss Kirkland, like mother, like daughter. Patsy keeps skirts. I feel very confident about the future of WTJ TV. That's all I've got to say. Jack, do you want to see me? We've got a show to do. We'll discuss this privately. Don't ever do anything like that to me again. Charlotte meets the person behind the plot to destroy Frank's life. And I never dreamed you would react this way. I never dreamed you could do such a thing. Over my head without even consulting with me beforehand. When do you consult people about their surprise? When do you give someone a surprise that shifts their entire emotional social life? It won't shift if we don't let it. If you had stepped out to make trouble between us, you couldn't have done a bit.
shares a stakeout with a pair of cockeyed private eyes on the fall guy. And Jake and Corky help a desperate father and his doomed son escape from a notorious prison camp on the Gold Monkey. Erica finds a powerful new ally. Watch all my children following FYI with Al Linden next on ABC.